people to come forward, pick up a name and read it aloud for each person who has died as a result of Australia's immigration policies since 2012. Saeed Ibrahim Hussain. Matthew Taylor. Matthew Taylor. Unnamed. Unnamed. Rakib Khan. 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 Coming weeks, months and years, we need to work together to stop deportations of all refugees to danger. We must bring an end to criminal practice of locking up people in offshore detention centres and change other criminal policies of our government. These people are victims of war that too often the Australian government is responsible for. Progressive forces in this country must show leadership on this very important issue. The trade union movement that is capable of mobilizing hundreds of thousands of people to change the rules also has the power to bring an end to the cruelty towards refugees. One hundred and fifty thousand Australian student strikers and supporters took to the streets with the demands: stop Adani coal mine, no new coal or gas, one hundred percent renewable energy by 2030. In the world, this week was the 34th week of global school striking for climate. We can't continue being unsustainable, digging up sacred land, consuming goods like there's no tomorrow. There is a tomorrow. We assert that tomorrow is ours. If we defeat Adani, we win the idea in the public imagination that at some point Australia has to stop pouring fossil fuels into the rest of the world. And somehow that, that's not our problem and it's not our responsibility. It is, you know, that's, that's why it's so vital, vital that, that, we, that we win this.